A social media post is what made a reunion possible for a father and son. Mike McLaughlin, who lives in Dallas, spent years searching for a son. And then a San Antonio nonprofit stepped in. Jaffany Gray tells us the rest of the story. I gotta be honest with you, I was in tears when I got the call. For three years, Mike McLaughlin has been searching for his 40-year-old son, James. James has had a troubled life, and he suffers from a mental illness that makes it difficult for him to communicate. In 2018, he got out of prison and was living in Kerrville with family until... He just dis disappeared one day. Mike, who lives in Dallas, says he tried everything to find a son. I have missing persons reports. I hired people to try to find him. In a desperate attempt, Mike took to Facebook with this post June of 2021. And while wishing a mutual friend a happy birthday, Don White Fosdick saw the post. She's the president of Christian Assistance Ministry here in San Antonio. She and her staff recognize that same man. He's been their client for three years. He comes to our place to get food and clothing. Fosdick and Mike connected on Facebook. And we know where your son is. He is safe. He is on the street. And I think he suffers from some mental health issues. But he's well cared for. The way it transpired, uh, I think God had a hand in Mike and James even got a chance to meet around Thanksgiving. I brought him over and I said, James, your dad's here to see you. I got to hug him and tell him I love him. And uh, yeah, I, I get emotional just thinking about it. Now, James does communicate with his father, but he does so by mail. Every day he comes to this mail room to check to see if he received the letter. This was no accident. It was a miracle. You don't give up hope. You don't know what thing you might do could change circumstances for the better. Jaffany Gray, KSAT 12 News.